Hello from Southern California. This is the DealershipNews.com podcast, where we bring you the new and old school insight into the business of selling cars and service so you have the foresight to grow your dealership and stay ahead of the competition. I'm Kelly Kleinman, and here is our show. Hello, Kelly here in my secretive vacation lair, located deep in the back country of Ventura County, home to jackrabbits, rattlesnakes, cougar, raccoons, wildfires, and a glut of subpar plastic surgeons. Bidding one and all happy holidays. Um, welcome to our quick cast. I'm happy to have for the next 120 seconds plus Brian Allen. He is the senior VP of Hire Car, a truly unique opportunity for car dealers to monetize vehicles both new and used as they sit on the lot. In my humble opinion, this is by far the single most innovative plan to conquer the automotive universe that I've heard of in the last couple of years. Hence, Brian, you are the Dealership News Innovation of the Year for 2019. Congrats. Holy mackerel there. Well, thank you very much. It was very kind. Yeah, well, I mean, it speaks for itself. It's, uh, it's very progressive. And uh, I think that's what we strive to do here in the, in the industry is come up with some progressive solutions that, uh, that work. Um, Brian, if you will, what was the genesis of the idea? Tell us what the company's accomplished this year. And then what do we have in store for us in 2020? Well, the original genesis of Hire Car was simply to solve a problem that existed, and that was there were a number of people that wanted to drive for Uber, Lyft, or food and package delivery services, and they didn't have a qualifying vehicle. And rental car agencies traditionally will not rent to a ride-hailing driver or for commercial purposes. So two gentlemen founded the company on an original basis of peer-to-peer, Andy and Abby uh, are, are the two original founders. And what they did was they simply prov- uh, secured a very unique insurance platform to insure these drivers and rent peer to peer. So if you think of the Airbnb business model, they were connecting vehicles that uh, drivers that needed vehicles for ride share and package delivery with people who owned vehicles that had an extra car in the garage. And then the business grew so fast that peer-to-peer was not solving the supply problem. So I joined the company from a dealer perspective and OEM perspective and said, let's get vehicle supply from large dealers and fleet owners. And that's basically what's happened. And frankly, we're the leading source by far of supplying vehicles to those that need to rent them. Uh, for commercial purposes, such as ride hailing and package delivery. And you should know, real quick background for those that don't don't know you, Brian, real quick background. You got a pretty good one. Well, it, it's been a lot of fun. I, my background is retail, uh, general manager at Galpin Motors, and I oversaw the luxury and uh, the Japanese division, uh, Mazda. And we, uh, I was there since 85, oh my goodness, uh, almost 40 years. So I retired last year. Uh, and then invested in higher car and then became a part of the team. And uh, it's, it's an absolute blast because I love dealerships and this is another model to help dealerships build revenue with resources they already have. Yeah, it's a total no brainer. By the way, those of you who aren't familiar with Gallup and Ford, it's a tiny little Ford dealer out in LA in the corner of nowhere. Uh, <laughs> It's the biggest Ford dealership in the world. Uh, Brian, congratulations. Looking forward to working with you in 2020 and getting some more um, automotive news that, uh, that we can all use. Appreciate it. Have a great holiday and congrats again. Well, thank you for the recognition. An amazing show and I love what you do. Thank you very much. Take care. Cheers.